Joe Mitterera, often called Joe Mad, born December 1974, is a comic book writer, artist and game developer, best known for his work on Marvel Comics' Uncanny X-Men and his creator-owned comic book Battle Chasers. Mitterera's style combines Western comic book influences most notably the influence of artist Arthur Adams though it evolved to incorporate heavy influences from Japanese manga and video games. Early life Joe Mitterera was born December 1974 to an American mother and a Portuguese father from the Azores. He attended the High School of Art and Design in Manhattan. Career At age 16, while still in high school, Madureira started at Marvel Comics as an intern, working under editor Danny Fingeroth. Madureira's art, which was heavily influenced by Arthur Adams, was first published in an eight-page story for the anthology series Marvel Comics Presents No. 89 November 1991, starring Mojo, and then a story starring Northstar in issue No. 92 December 1992. Despite the order of publication, Mitterera drew the Mojo story second, as the influence of Arthur Adams, who co-created Mojo, is more evident in that story, and is closer to the style for which Mitterera was known in the initial part of his career. His style would later evolve as he incorporated the influence of Japanese manga. In 1993, Mitterera penciled the first Deadpool miniseries, The Circle Chase. That same year, he drew Vanguard No. 3 for Eric Larson's studio, which was published by Image Comics. Mitterera became the regular penciler on Uncanny X-Men in 1994. During the Age of Apocalypse storyline, all X-Men titles were renamed. Mitterera illustrated Uncanny X-Men's replacement as the four-issue miniseries Astonishing X-Men, Volume 1. He left Uncanny X-Men in 1997 to work on his own sword and sorcery series Battle Chasers for Wildstorm Comics creator-owned Cliffhanger Imprint before it was sold to DC Comics. Shortly before leaving Uncanny X-Men, he commented that he felt the series had become too dark and depressing. For his taste, Mitterera produced a total of nine issues in four years publishing two to three a year, a pace for which he was criticized. He cancelled Battle Chasers No. 10, and placed the series on indefinite hiatus after forming a game development company called Tri-Lunar with Tim Donnelly and Greg Peterson. With Tri-Lunar, he created concept art on a game called Dragonkind which was cancelled when Tri-Lunar went out of business. He then went to work for Realm Interactive, another startup company, on Trade Wars, Dark Millennium. When Realm Interactive was acquired by NC Soft, he continued to contribute to the game as it evolved into Exarch, and was eventually released as Dungeon Runners. As creative director at THQ, he helped develop the game Darksiders, including designing the game's characters and settings. Collaborator Joe Kelly wrote the game's script. Mitterera returned to the comic book industry as the artist on Marvel's The Ultimates 3, with writer Jeff Loeb. The second issue was published in January 2008, the third issue released on February 20, 2008. Ultimates 3 No. 4 came out on June 25, 2008. In July 2007, Vigil Games Darksiders was announced, of which Joe Madureira was creative director. It follows War, one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, on his quest to find out who prematurely triggered the apocalypse. It was released on Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 on January 5, 2010. Madureira has also provided cover artwork for Capcom's Marvel Super Heroes for the Sega Saturn and Sony PlayStation, and the Sony PlayStation game Gekido, Urban Fighters. On June 13, 2011, it was announced that he would be handling art duties on a new series written by Zeb Wells entitled Avenging Spider Man. Following a three issue run on the title, Marvel announced on March 11, 2013, that Midorera would be re teaming with Wells for an story arc on Savage Wolverine beginning with No. 6 in June 2013. Early in 2015, Joe Midorera and Ryan Stefanelli, co founders of Vigil Games, formed a new studio, Airship Syndicate, located in Austin, Texas, and announced that their first project, a game adapted from Battle Chasers. Battle Chasers, Night War was released in October 2017 for Microsoft Windows, Mac OS, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, and in May 2018 for Nintendo Switch and Linux. Personal life 
Mitterera has a daughter, who was six years old as of June 2011. Topic: <laughs> Selected bibliography. Escalibur hash 57 to 58, Marvel Comics, 1992. Deadpool: The Circle Chase hash 1 to 4, Marvel Comics, 1993. Uncanny X-Men hash 312 to 313, 316 to 317, 325 to 326, 328 to 330, 332, 334 to 338, 340 to 343, 345 to 348, 350. Marvel Comics, 1994 to 1997. Astonishing X-Men hash 1 to 4 Marvel Comics 1995 Battle Chasers number 0 hash 1 to 9 Cliffhanger Image Comics 1998 to 2001 Ultimates 3 hash 1 to 5 Marvel Comics 2008 Avenging Spider-Man hash 1 to 3 Marvel Comics 2011-2012 Savage Wolverine hash 6 to 8 Marvel Comics 2013 Inhuman hash 1 to 3 Marvel Comics 2014 equals equals notes <laughs>